How's it everybody? Celtic Link here. We're back for another Dokkan battle video. In today's video, we're continuing the grand tour of LR Gohan and Piccolo. Guess it's my turn. Alrighty, so we are running him up against the Janemba Memorial Battle, because like the Gogeta, this is one of the hardest fights in the game um it's I, I mean especially for a unit like gohan and piccolo where they kind of need some time to build up so i'm kind of curious how they would do here in a situation where they're not really afforded at time and we saw they kind of did all right in gogeta so i'm kind of curious how that's going to go here um in janemba so unfortunately we didn't get them turn one and uh we're, we're trying to something a little bit different so we, we actually have the exchange vegeta and piccolo because they do count as a namekian which would fulfill his passive um but the only thing is is they're really only helpful on turn oh actually that's not too bad considering that's the first attack we took okay so we're good for the rest of the turn actually um as long as vegeta and piccolo dodge which they should be able to since we have the all-out struggle uh category requirement for the vegeta um, but I mean, basically my theory is they show up one turn, they dodge, and then every turn they show up again after that, you have Beast Gohan's protection you don't have to worry about them, but they're literally here just to fulfill, uh, conditions, um, for Gohan. That's, that's basically all they're here for. <laughs> um, there we go. All right. So we get the 18 key with, Gen uh, with... Vegeta. Now, the nice thing about this fight is Janemba doesn't nullify all of our uh, physical super attacks, so we can actually land our hits compared to Gogeta. Like, Gogeta's one took kind of long because of that fact, but that won't be happening here, so we actually should have a little bit of an easier time. Alright, there we go. Alright, moment of truth. Uh, will a dodge. If they don't dodge, obviously we lose. There we go. We get the dodge. Yes. Okay. And now we're solid. We don't have to worry about anything ever again for them. Alrighty, so with that, okay, so we do have him, okay, he links, alright, he's got four links with Beast Gohan, so I think, well, we know the super attack is at the end. Hmm, this does mean we're going to have to forego a super from Beast, because we have, Gohan and Piccolo does activate the unit super. For Beast Gohan. It, um, oh, this is going to be tough. Okay. We're taking a huge risk here. Because now we won't have the... By do, ooh, wow. Yeah, okay. So, not having a Namekian on the turn is... That's rough. <laughs> Alright, but at least we're going to get our stacks in. I remember they do stack on the 12 key. We get an additional normal. No. Only one stack. Ooh, so that's kind of hurting. Alright, so because we got the unit super, now Beast Gohan isn't going to take an attack. And that's going to hurt us, I think, um, due to the fact uh, that now that Piccolo and Vegeta are going to come on and they're not going to have any protection... This is going to be tough. And only one stack, man. That's rough. That's rough. Only one stack. Well, I mean, not every every event's going to be perfect. And unfortunately, this is a short event. doesn't really lend itself well to a character like them. But I imagine they'll do a lot better in, like, Goku Frieza or Gogeta. Um, or, heck, even Cell Max in, in events that can be a little bit longer to give them time to build up. But, I mean, we'll see. We will definitely do the those showcases, uh, the ones we can here. There we go. 
And there goes the super. All we need is Tech UI to do the thing he do. Yes, he does. Perfect. Like I told you, King Piccolo was the old me. This is not going to end like it did before. Excellent. Okay, so now... Honestly, I was going to say it kind of sucks that he's showing up now, but um, it's probably for the best because it's going to give him the most amount of uptime with his entrance passive. And, I mean, he can't take a hit anyways here, so, I mean, just floating him off is probably the, for the best. And we don't know where the super attack here is, so we got to kind of hope it's pre-super on Beast because if it's post-super, we could potentially die here. Ooh, well, I mean, maybe we'll just negate it altogether. Alright, we get the additional super with Beast Gohan. Perfect. Oh, we get another additional super. Perfect. Okay, so we're doing a bit of damage here. Alright. Ooh, oh, well, he does have a long cooldown. He might not super at all. Although, if he does super Vegeta, we are dead here. Um, yeah, this is going to be tough. Okay, normal. Ooh, wow, that normal did a lot. Ooh, that is such a huge difference. Jeez. Okay, well, at the very least, we know we have the revive now, so that's good. There we go. Okay, so. It is turn four. All right, perfect. That means we can trans uh, exchange Piccolo and Gohan here. So... Yeah, let's go ahead and let's exchange them. I have just obtained the ultimate power. Mr. Piccolo. Sorry to keep you waiting. Yes, yes, we can do this. We can do this. All right, I know this is going to be able to kill Janimbo with this turn, so we'll throw Beast Gohan in front again. Huge risk we're taking here. We are assuming Beast and um, Piccolo will kill here, which I, I'm confident they can. Um, our only issue... Well, you know what? No, we've already been hit. We're going to super attack. I think Beast can survive the super if he decides to super. We get the additional super attack. Okay. If he supers this turn, I do think Beast can survive it, just simply because we did get that hit in. Alright, let's see what happens here. Okay, well, he's not supering. Alright, 22 million. That's actually pretty impressive coming out of him. And we get the crit for 12 million! That is what I'm talking about. Grill Master himself. Now, unfortunately, we didn't get the additional super. But we do... Oh, there's the super. And it's on Piccolo's guaranteed dodge turn. Because we're below the HP threshold. Yes! Perfect. Okay. Oh, thank goodness. <laughs> wow. Okay. That was lucky. Now, I'm just going to go ahead and be stupid right here. We could end this right now by just popping these active skills or whatever. But I'm going to be stupid and I'm going to let uh, Vegeta die here. So we can just throw the Grill Master out one more time. Oh, no. Never mind. Okay. Vegeta kills. Okay. <laughs> I was hoping we would die here. Okay. Well... <laughs> Uh, the one time Vegeta doesn't fraud out on me. Okay, well, there you have it, folks. There is Gohan and Piccolo, the Grill Master, up against the hardest stage on Global Dokkan currently. This is a whole different style of event, one that, quite honestly, this dude is not 
made for. I mean, let's be completely honest. They're not. Gohan can do all right for the first turn or two, as long as you have a Namekian on the cat on the team. But the bigger issue is that, well, I mean, look at our options. <laughs> kind of struggling here, but we made it work. Um, Beast is probably definitely his best team for now until Planet Namek Saga gets a little bit better. Then I think he has a better home on that team. But for now, this works. So, guys, that is it for the video. If you like the video, make sure you hit that like button and subscribe to the channel if you have not already. And in the comments down below, let us know what are your thoughts so far on Gohan and Piccolo. We've putting them through the ringer here. We still got the long grand tour coming. Make sure you tune in for that tomorrow when that drops. But they're looking pretty good so far. But I'm curious what you think. Let us know in the comments down below. Otherwise, guys, as always, thanks for watching and aloha.